Good coffee morning, and welcome back to <laughs> This Should Have Been Presented Better. So, had uh, a few topics, and none of them have percolated up to the top of this, sh whatever this is, brain in a bag, right? So all esoteric things aside, virus response, America's virus response in comparison to the rest of the world's virus response. Have you noticed a difference in just going, look at anything but the news media, go find websites with some reasonable foundation behind them. Look for mortality rates by nation for whatever it is that you want to uh, patent and copyright the inoculation for. Because that's what it's going to take possibly for this disease to minimize the deaths from this disease. The inoculation happens in one of two ways. It's natural through population exposure or somebody with much more focus than this creates a vaccine. Today that somebody has access to a billion dollars in science and research resources developed and sitting on supercomputers in databases bigger than your mind can stretch into so you have to have tools to look into this amount of information. So why am I speaking to information and analysis? I see across the majority of the planet nations that are trying to legitimately report statistics and values on the spread of what is a near what is a 4 to 10% death rate virus. Polio was a 10% death rate virus. The flu I believe is a 1.6% death rate virus. But don't quote me. Go look up for yourself how this is being effected across the globe. So if you understand a little bit about statistical analysis and possibilities and how things have worked through history because that defines the possibilities our history does. Our ancient hundreds of thousands of years now of learning and a damn lot of it sitting in computers. I get the fiction. I love it. In the meanwhile, so, what we're seeing is the worst statistical information capture among most of the civilized nations on this planet. This comes from an insecurity among the population in what we know, a fed insecurity, full of rabbit holes that people have dug. So in this coffee break, I have hopped across a number of rabbit holes. You can turn into frequencies and crystals and woo or magic underwear, and it has been done. You can turn it into a fleet of yachts based upon boxes of garbage in people's garages. 
based upon hiding corporate gains inside of religious activities. It is Bain Capital funneling billions of dollars into the Mormon church and hiding their assets inside the church and going on holiday handing out Bibles from their corporate jets. This is what we've invented. This is what's come of this nonsense in conversations. So how do you get past that? How do you lead someone away from a one book reference? How do you step them out of that? Maybe this will help. We're old. Have a burrito.